Okay, um, we're back. Welcome back then to your next lesson. And this time, we're gonna divide decimals by 10, 100, 1000, or 10,000. Now this time, uh, this is easy. Why? Because we divide decimals by these numbers, all we need to do is copy the number or our dividend, then move the decimal point to the left depending on the number of zeros our divisor have. Okay? So I'm going to explain that by using an, an example. Okay? If we have here 32.51 divided by 10, for example. Okay? So, all we need to do is copy that dividend, okay, which is 32.51, and move the decimal point to the left of our number, depending on how many zeros our divisor have, okay. In, in, in this case, 10, so we have 1, 0. We need to say, we're gonna move the decimal point one step to the left of our number. So our decimal point here will be in between B and 2. Therefore, our answer here is 3.251. Okay? So 32.51 divided by 10 is 3.251. That's it. Okay. Well, let's have some more example. Or maybe if we're gonna use this example the same, how about divided by 100? Okay. So first, let's copy our dividend, which is 32.51, and move the decimal point to the left of our number, depending on how many zeros our divisor have okay in this case we have 100 we have two zeros so we need to say from here we're gonna have two steps to the left okay to have our, to have our answer so let's count one two so our decimal point will be here so our answer will be zero point three two five Okay, that's how you divide using 10, 100, 1,000, or 10,000. Okay, so let's have some more examples. Okay, so we have here a decimal number divided by a whole number which is 1,000. How to answer this? Simple. Just copy our dividend, which is 526.78. And move our decimal point to the left of our number, depending on how many numbers our divisor, or how many zeros our divisor have. In this case, we have three. Which is 1,000 and have three zeros. So we need to say we're going to step three steps to the left because we have three zeros in 1,000. Okay, so let's count. One, two, three. Okay, so we have our decimal point here. See? And then side zero. Okay, so 526.78 divided by 1,000 is 0 0.52670. That's how you divide, okay? How about we're gonna use 10,000? Okay. So, it's the same procedure. How to answer this? Just copy our dividend, which is 526.78. 70 and move the decimal point 
to the left depending on how many zeros our device will have. In this case, we have 4 because we have 10,000 and we got the zeros as 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. So we need to say we're going to move our decimal point here 4 steps to the left. Okay, so let's count. 1, 2, 3, and 4. So we have still one step here. So to correct the steps, we're going to add 0 here. Okay, so 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 steps on the left. So 0 here. So our answer is 0 0.05267. That's how you uh, divide decimals by 10, 100, 1000, or 10,000. Let's have some more examples. Group 3. Okay. So we have a decimal number divided by 100. So the same procedure. How to answer? Just copy the dividend is 1.234 then just move the decimal point to the left depending on how many zeros our device will have okay. in this case we have 100 so we have two zeros so we need to say we're going to move the decimal point two steps to the left now let's count mm -hmm. so one two okay so we still have one digit here Let's add zero. Decimal point here, zero. So we have zero point zero one two three. That's how you divide decimals by ten, one hundred, one thousand, or ten thousand. Okay. So how? Just copy the dividend. Then move the decimal point to the left depending on how many zeros our device should have. Okay, that's how you divide decimals by 10, 100, 1000, or 10,000. Okay, so thank you for your time, Ben. See you next meeting.